Right, we're standing here with ACE skipper uh, Gareth Hopkins. Uh, just completed a training session down here at College Rifles, prepped for the Champions League, which they're off to pretty soon. You guys are looking pretty sharp out there. You're um, confident in how the team's shaping up? Yeah, I am. Uh, I've always been putting in some pre hard yards since April, May, fitness wise and strength wise. So, uh, boys are in good nick and um, things come around nicely. Now you've got people sort of coming in from all over the shop, I guess, you know, from overseas and, and overseas professionals and stuff as well. Um, what are you going to do to try and sort of get that team unity that was fantastic during the HRV Cup? Yeah, it was. Uh, we've got the team unity here. The boys that have been, um, been training all winter. The guys, when they come back in the core, feel pretty comfortable, slip back straight into the standards that we set. And uh, I don't think the guys from the, from the English uh, county season, when they come back, they're... Capital, um, Andre and Lou and Hope and Jimmy, uh, when they come back you'll fit in fine I'm sure. Cool. Are you ha happy with the balance that you've got in the, in the squad? Yeah definitely. I think it's, um, if you look at all the areas, uh, open batting through the middle, order batting through the hitters to guys who run hard, uh, good fielding, we've got some very experienced bowlers um, and the spinners are great. So I mean the balance across the side is, is, and depth is outstanding and I think the hardest thing will be uh, is be naming the, the top 11. Absolutely. So it's a pretty cutthroat start to the competition, but I guess if you get through that qualifying tournament, it's almost the perfect lead into the main comp, isn't it? Oh, absolutely, yeah. It's uh, tough games um, in those conditions. Um, when we win two games, we get on a bit of momentum and a bit of a roll like the HRV Cup and we'll hit that competition proper uh, and it's a really good step. Excellent. Now you've played in India before. How hard is it used, getting used to sort of being in those conditions and playing in those conditions? Yeah, it takes a few days. Um, walk off the plane and the heat sort of hits you and the humidity. Um, but uh, we have things in place. We've got protocols in place now, which um, which uh, are set up so we can optimise the protocols. And at the end of the day, we do this nice chatting on the wall and not worry too much about the road or heat lights or what the conditions are like. It's just a matter of doing the best for that particular delivery. So the guys, the guys that know that, and, uh, they're in good shape. Now, just in, on your position as skipper, I know you, you really love. Um, being captain. Is Wicketkeeper a really good place to do that from on, on a cricket field? Yeah, it is. It is. I mean, ideally, you can see the angles. Um, you can see how the bowlers are, are trucking. You can see uh, where the batters are struggling. So you can sort of adapt the plans pretty well. And I'm in touch with all the fielders as well. So, so it is great. Um, took a little bit of use, getting used to when I first started doing it um, and, and concentrating on the team and on campaign and concentrating on the job. But the more you do it, like anything, the more you do it, the better you get it. Excellent. And I guess finally, uh, you'll be hoping, uh, no offence to Jimmy, that his Hampshire side loses at the weekend. And yeah. He was a really important part of the side, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. He was, he was a great asset for us, I think. Um, what he brought to our team last summer was the experience that um, to read a game, to understand on certain conditions what a good total is, also to understand who he's batting with and uh, the tempo that they're going at and how to um, coordinate um, with that better. And, um, set up a run chase or if it's setting a total at the right tempo. Awesome. Alright, thanks heaps for talking to us, Hobby, and good yeah. luck at the Champions League. Thank you very much. Cheers.